Sì, eh, lo fa buono, sì. Sì, mm. prego. Oh. Sì. Good morning, good day, good day fam, good day. So today is 5th August 2021 and today is Michael and Mommy's birthday. Michael turned 6 today. They both share the same birthday. Nana Bima, Vesta Nana too is also plus one today. These three people. Oh, and mom is not feeling well, so I can't even celebrate it. Michael hmm, has been disturbing me to celebrate this party for him. I said, no, there is not. I, I, right now, I'm disoriented, seriously. Mom's illness has disorganized my mind. So, she's having a bath now. I've made oats for her. After that, I'll take her to the lab to run more laps. Yes, the doctor gave us more laps to run. So I'll take her to the lab to run more laps. Then I'll go and buy her glucometer to check to check her sugar level because of the diabetes. We have to keep checking it. Then I'll buy the rest of her drugs. Michael woke up so fussy. I don't know if it's because it's his sixth birthday. I hear when kids turn six, they behave somehow in the morning when they wake up because when he woke up and i started singing happy birthday to him he said he frowned he was like this is it because i told him i will not celebrate it for him he knows what is happening he knows grandma is sick but you know kids will always be kids mom is not feeling well at all she woke up very sick she really woke up very sick again after the hospitalization everything so after the lapse when she's she's still not okay i'll take her back to the hospital i think her sugar level is acting up again. Oh my god, I'm so tired. I feel pains all over my body, my neck. I can feel my neck here, my back, my joints, Charlie. It's not easy, but Baba God no go shame us. Keep praying for us, fam. I really appreciate all your prayers, seriously. I really appreciate all your prayers. And please wish Mom, Michael, and Nana Bema, Vesta Nana, a happy birthday for me in the comment section. So I'm going to have my bag too, and we'll go from there. And I'll buy her drugs and everything. So let's go. Yes. Mama, you're going to see from the lab now yeah we are back from the lab i took her to the lab and also to go and buy the rest of her medications and the glucometer so i bought the glucometer and the strips this is used to check the sugar level 
so I'm done so I'm about to check a sugar level now and I'll make something for her to eat Catch you later Is a number two, why? So, her dietitian gave her a list of foods to eat and not to eat. So, her diet has practically changed. You understand me? It has really changed. So, she's allowed to eat plantain fufu. The one I just made for her, she just ate a, a little, she ate not even half. So, the half is still there. I don't think she will even eat it. She, she will not even eat it. So, later in the day. I'll go to the market and buy the other stuff. I'll buy brown rice, some vegetables, wheat, and fruits, a whole lot of stuff. Her diet has changed. So that's the list they gave me. You know how diabetics, their diet, their meal plans are. So nowadays, when I want to cook, I'll cook our meal separately and cook her separately. But now I'll be following her diet too because I can see that even though the diet is expensive, it is really good for her hair. Yes, I can tell it's really good for her health. So I'll follow it so that she'll get better. Because changing her diet has will, will, will help her, yes. Will help her to, you know, adjust. You know, this diabetes, it's not, it's not easy at all. It's not easy. So... Michael, dear, yeah, he's still around. He's been fussy as always. So I'll catch you later. Okay, your birthday boy. Birthday boy. Six years old. Wow. God is good. <laughs> my dear, I'll see okay. My auntie is here. Birthday boy is so hyper today. This is how we are celebrating his birthday. Mm -hmm. Hyper, hyper song. Everybody is down because mom is not well. Everybody is down, but I'm happy because Michael is plus one and mom is plus one. Then I will hear me, then I won. If you're not one, Michael, Michael. Sabo, Ochiala, Ochiala. Michael Brabranco Jerry. I'm sorry. Brabby Branco Jerry. Oh, Brabra. Bessie Uncle Jerry. Hey, life. Ah, one, one time you are happy, that time you are sad, one time you are. I don't even know how to describe this life. This life, seriously, I always say this life in no balance at all. Whew. Mom, we couldn't sleep last night. We were up all night. She was just restless. The pain, the cough. She was just coughing, coughing, coughing. And you can tell from that, from you can tell from her looks that she's feeling the pain. We didn't sleep, fam. And her sugar kept shooting. Thank God it has come down. She fell asleep two hours ago. She's awake. She's awake now. I can hear her calling on Anna. She fell asleep just two hours ago. So I have I think it's seven. So I'll go and I'll go and check her blood sugar, her fasting blood sugar. Yes, I'm supposed to check her fasting blood sugar. It's when you wake up fresh, then you check it. Then I'll jot it down. I'll be taking it to the hospital now for review. I, I don't want to ch take chances. I don't want to take chances at all. Thank God I'm home. Thank God I'm home. If I wasn't home, what would have happened to her? Bruh. That's it. What would have happened to her? We just thank God. So I want to go and check her sugar level now. Then 
prepare her for the hospital. Go better. I'll check her sugar level. This is her yes.